Welcome back to my channel. We're going to be doing a Ipsy unbagging today. I am super excited so far. I have really been enjoying this subscription. Um, so let's just go ahead and dive right into it. This is the bag for this month. I'm not a fan of this bag. Um, I don't know. It just the mushiness, uh, the mesh feeling just I don't know, it kind of reminds me of a summertime versus a springtime bag just because this kind of reminds me of maybe like the shoes you wear to the pool or in the pool or something like that. But either way, this is the bag. <laughs> um, and then it just has a rope on the end. No big deal. And we're going to open that straight up and we're going to go into this right here. So this month is I Will Conquer for, and it says Game Face. So the first thing we get in the bag, what is, oh, okay, Ho Ola Neon is a velvet liquid lipstick. I like the box of this. Look how neat that is. I really like the design of this box. I've never heard of this brand before, so I'm super, super excited. It says it's free of parabens, gluten, and it says this product has never been tested on animals, so that is a huge plus. All right, already good, off to a good start. Let's open this up. <laughs> oh, I ripped it, but it says, you open it up and it says, hola, babe, <laughs> in the little tab. That's a cute little touch. All right, so this is the liquid lipstick. This is what it looks like. Um, I will say that it feels really cheap. Um, a very, very light plastic, almost kind of like a kid's makeup would feel. Um, but other than that, I do like the shape of it. So let's go ahead and open this up and swatch it. Kind of, kind of smells like a jelly bean. <laughs> All right. Ooh, very pretty color. All right, so there is your swatch right there. It looks a little patchy in the swatch, so we are going to test that on um, we'll do that in just a little bit. Let's go ahead and get everything out of the palette first. All right, going back into my bag. The next thing we have is Mud Masky Sleep Repair Renewal Nourishing Mask. Okay. I'm all about face masks. See how this smells. No smell to it. It says it's repairing, hydrating, rejuvenating, smoothing, and protecting. It's kind of got a greasy feel to it. I'm not too enthusiastic about that, but we'll have to play with it some more um, and see see how I feel about that. Going back into the bag. Ooh, what is this? Oh yeah, Preventive Measures 101 After Hours Lip Balm. I love lip balms. I, I swear I own like 20. They're just all in different sections of the house and different sections of my purse and my car. I just, they live everywhere because I, I constantly have to keep them on my lips. So, Let's go ahead and break this seal. All right, so it is just a clear balm. Ooh, kind of got like a fruity smell to it. I like that. I want to. Ooh, I want to test that out. Um, we'll do that after we put on the lipstick. All right, we have two more things in the bag. This one's in a little bubble wrap, so we'll go ahead and try that. This is a City of Color contour palette. Okay. I've actually, I, I said I would never do it, but I am on, I have been getting into contouring lately. I've been contouring my forehead and my cheeks, not tonight, but um, I've been playing with it here and there, so I'm kind of excited about this. Um, it says it's a highlight, a bronzer, and a contour. All right, so it says it's a highlighter, 
a highlight, a bronzer, and a contour. So this right here would be your highlight, your bronzer, and your contour. Let's go ahead and swatch these and see what these look like. Ooh, ooh, that feels really, really soft. All right, so this is definitely kind of like a sheen highlight. And let's see. This would be your bronzer. All right, and this would be your contour. Okay. So there are the three swatches right there. Um, they feel really, really nice. They're really, really pigmented. I would say that bronzer is definitely a little bit too orange for my skin tone, so I won't be able to use that, but I can definitely use the highlight and I can use that contour. So, I'm excited about that. <laughs> All right, and going into the last product, we have a full-size Ciate London Fierce Flix Eyeliner. I'm assuming the color of this is black. Um, that is kind of standard for the subscription bags but we will open it up and find out. I've actually never used a Ciate London um, eyeliner before, so I'm pretty excited about it. <sighs> Always down to try new eyeliners and see if it works. Ugh, the struggle is real. Come on, come on, plastic. Be smarter than the plastic. Be smarter than the plastic. <laughs> you know, it's kind of hard sometimes. It's coming off in little sections. Ugh. You know what? We're just going to finish that later because I think I just broke a nail. All right, so we're going to pop that open. It is a felt tip eyeliner. I'm going to put that right here. Ooh. That feel it really, really nice. It is a deep black. Um, I'm really happy with that. I can't wait to try that out on a eye look. All right, so I went ahead and took off the lipstick that I had, and we are going to apply this color. Um, this color is called DF. So that's interesting. All right, so I do like this color. It is just kind of patchy. I did have to apply it several times. It feels pretty comfortable on the lips, so I will have to give this a further, uh, do some further testing on this, but so far, so good. Um, once you get those layers on there, it does look quite nice. All right, so I went ahead and took off the lipstick because I really, really want to try this lip balm since this is right up my alley. Kind of smells like a grapefruit. Mm. Oh yeah. I really like the way that feels. Mm. Oh yes. <laughs> this could have been the only thing in that bag and <laughs> this has definitely made my day. I love lip balms. Um, especially, oh my gosh, in the winter, gotta have it. So huge, huge plus on that. All right, so let's go ahead and recap like we always do. Um, re we received the Hula Neon Liquid Lipstick in the color DF. Um, it is never been tested on animals. Uh, we received the Sleep Mask uh, from Mud Masky. We received the Ciate London Fierce Fleek Eyeliner. Um, we also received the City Colors Contour Palette. Oop. And 
of course, the lip balm from Preventive Measures 101. Overall, I will say I'm pretty happy with this bag. I absolutely love this. This is definitely um, one of my favorite products out of this just because I am a lip balm junkie as, almost as much as I am a eyeshadow palette junkie. Um, who doesn't love a full size eyeliner, um, especially a brand that I do not have in my collection, so I'm really excited about that. Um, like I said, I have just recently gotten to contouring, so this is going to be put to good use. Um, the mask, I love masks. We'll see how I feel about this. It did feel a little bit greasy, but um, we will give this a shot, and hopefully it does work out. So masks are always a huge thing in my book. Um, and then we also received the liquid lipstick. Like I said, it did go on kind of patchy. I did have to apply it two to three times, but overall it was a gorgeous color and it felt really nice in the lips. And it does, and it is a full size lipstick. So I can definitely get over having to apply it, um, you know, twice. So that's not a big deal. So I am really, really happy with this bag. I would definitely continue my subscription to Ipsy. I hope you guys liked this review. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. You can also follow me on Instagram and I will have that link down below as well. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.